recording is the story after my heart. I really like the, the story written by Vivian and Gigi. Uh, it's the TV series that we're doing for AIT and we hope to do uh, more seasons. The first one, we just did the first 26 episode and we're looking forward to seeing how that goes. It's really a wonderful experience actually and uh, because I'm working with so many people for the first time we are actually not done on the set of When Love Comes Calling. I mean, we'll be wrapping set on Sunday. The actors were amazing. It was great bonding on the set. For some reason, I don't know why, but this particular set is one of the easiest, you know, sets I've been on. Everyone kind of bonded. Everyone worked together. There was synergy between the actors. The, the crew members were all, you know, together. It was nice. That is not to say that we didn't have challenges, we did a lot. But the actors, I brought about three of them from Ghana. And um, it was interesting. People asked me why, but um, I would say uh, making this series for a station that is international, I think it would only be nice to mix actors from different parts of Africa. And since we're kind of familiar with the Ghanaian actors, I brought about three of them. Uh, Kofi Adelolo, whom I've worked with uh, in other, uh, on other sets, he's a wonderful person to work with. And Ian Mordi, another Ghanaian actor, was great. And uh, Omar Krupp, this was my first time work, um, working with Omar. Omar did very well on the set. His interpretation was amazing. And the Nigerian actors, Matilda Obaseki, one of my favorites. She's a wonderful actress. She did so well. And there's so many new actors. There's somebody who came in from the United States. Her name is uh, Jessie Ikama Itumia. She, she's, she's one of the lead characters on the set. She did really, really well. Ike Chupu is actually a singer turned actor. And he played one of the lead characters. He did quite well. Bibo Ademoye was on this on this set. Barbara Soki, Susan Peters, and so many uh, Royal Art students as well. I used a lot of them on this set, both uh, in front of the camera and behind the, the scene. My production manager, the assistant directors. I worked with um, Smart Edikan, Mary Uye, um, Nelson, Larissa, Chiefly, Ese. Uh, there are quite a number of them, I think. We must have had about 10 Royal Arts students and um, they did so well. Most of them I'm going to continue working with, especially behind the scenes. They are, they are quite good at what they do and of course they're still learning on the job. Okpoyemi was an AD, uh, is an AD on the set of When Love Comes Calling and he happens to be one of the teachers at Royal Arts Academy. It was a wonderful experience working with him as well. In as much as I like being on set, it's actually quite addictive to me. A lot of times, it's also very strenuous and very tiring and very challenging. I'm back in the office. Of course, the admin aspect of this work has to be attended to. When love comes calling, it's going to hit your TV screen very soon. Make sure you keep your eyes glued to this channel as we keep you updated on what's happening. Not just for when love comes calling, of so many other projects that we are doing and um, keep watching <laughs>